not scary. So it's not, boo, you know, a Halloween kind of uh, fear, scary, you know. <laughs> not that. It's how do you actually uh, inject that uncertainty of what's happening after fear for what may come. And the most unexpected places, Mozart, at the end of the D minor fantasy, you have the last six bars of the minor element. I mean, they're really not very much in the music. I mean, you can do whatever you want with it. And people played it very beautifully over hundreds of years. But I wanted to create something that was you know, a little different for me, uh, at least so that I uh, find it more meaningful. So I created fear. That's what I'm thinking. You probably won't think, oh my god, that's scary. But this is how it translates. those rests is what creates fear. That is what I'm thinking. You probably aren't thinking that it's fearsome, but it creates the suspense and drama, and most importantly, it really juxtaposes what's coming after. Uh, to me, that's fantasy, one of my favorite pieces, is a nightmare, but it's a nightmare with a happy ending, because your whole first section, you're in the dark. You're alone in the dark, fighting with your demons, with your nightmares, with, with all those scary things, and then, right there, when the moment of most fear, your my character is at the window, and this is where the first ray of the sun lands on your face. We've all experienced, if you've ever been up early enough to see a sunrise, like I have today, on the plane, there is this first ray of sun that pierces the darkness, and it is remarkable, and you just sort of feel reborn and that is what this music is but in order for it to work there needs to be darkness before it and there needs to be despair and fear and to help me polarize this i'm playing into a fear emotion and rests are great with fear if you work with silences they're the most terrifying loudest sounds that there are because it is what's coming after that we don't know and the, the more you manipulate the silence in an informed way, the more terrifying what's coming after will be. And if you manage to surprise people and yourself, well, then all the power to you, because that's really the goal of the silence, is, is to uh, leave us in this space between, uh, yeah, suspended, as it were.